Goodwill Community Foundation, creating opportunities for a better life. Safari makes browsing the web quick and easy. In this video, we'll talk about the basics of browsing, such as navigating to a website, using tabs, viewing history, and downloading files. To visit a website, find the address bar at the top of the browser, type in a web address, and press Enter. Your website will then appear. In order to search the web, return to the address bar and type in a search term. As you type, related suggestions will appear. You can either click one of these suggestions, or you can press Enter. A list of results will appear, and you can click on one to check it out. There are three main buttons used for navigation. The back and forward buttons allow you to move through pages you've recently viewed. The refresh button will reload the current page. You can use refresh if a website stops working or if you want to see if the page has been updated. Tabs allow you to have multiple web pages open in the same window. To open a new tab, click the plus sign in the top right corner and use it to visit any website you desire. To see a different tab, click on the one you wish to view. Close a tab by clicking the X on the left. When you find a link on a website, you can view it in a new tab by right-clicking it, then selecting Open Link in New Tab. Feel free to open as many as you'd like. Let's look at all of them at once by clicking on the Tab Overview button in the top right, then clicking on whichever one you want. You can move them by clicking and dragging one to the desired position, then releasing the mouse. You can even pull one to a new window of its own. Just click and drag it away, and once you release the mouse, it will open in its own window. If you found a file on the web that you want to save to your computer, you can download the file by clicking on the link, and it may download automatically. However, if it doesn't, you can right-click on it and select Download Linked File As. Give the file a name, select the location where you want to save the file, then click Save. To check its progress, click the Download button in the top right corner, and when it's finished downloading, you can double-click the file to open it. Every website you visit is remembered in a record known as your browsing history and you can view it by clicking History at the top of the screen and clicking Show All History. It's organized by time frames, and you can click on the arrows to shrink or expand the contents of a time frame. To return to a website, double-click on it. Now you know the essentials of browsing with Safari. 